Hi guys, it's Wednesday evening at 5.30. No clue what the date is, I believe it's 4.22. Uh, a couple of things just wanted to touch base on. Um, you know, it's been about six weeks we've been in the house and I know that we're all experiencing different levels of anxiety. I get that and if you guys know who Mel Robbins is, Carolyn shared, Carrie shared with me who Mel Robbins was. If you don't know who she is, follow her on Instagram. She's got a lot of really good insightful positive things and one of the things she was talking about today was anxiety and we all we are all experiencing some level so I know personally one of the best things for me one of the best tools that I have to handle anxiety is to exercise so me being here with you I tell you all the time this is as much for me as it is for you so as selfish as that sounds I need you guys um, let's talk about our heart rate since I see a bunch of you are popping on Let's get our heart rate going and you can start counting pulse or wrist, start counting now. And stop. So that's our number, that's where we want to get to. I don't know if you guys saw my post a couple minutes ago. I just almost got hit in the head with a branch so my heart rate's a little high. Um, but I have a kitchen chair again, so if you want to grab a kitchen chair and join us, I have the music set up, I believe. Um, I don't know, I'll remember what I was thinking about earlier, but I'm glad you guys are here. Let's get moving. Hopefully you guys are joining the other ladies too. I see everyone's been putting stuff out. Um, if you don't have their, if you haven't friended them yet or you don't know who they are, you can message me and I'll get you to them. I've been trying to put them on my, on my timeline so that you can find them. Found a little more rock and roll guys. That gets my blood pumping, my heart rate up. Got your chair, got your weights, got your water, got your towel. Big march. Step touch right here. Sun is out. It's a little chilly. Double step, but not too cold to go for a walk. Get out there. Great find. Around the world arms. So maybe this isn't what I thought it was. We're gonna add a knee in. Get ready. Add that knee right here. One, two, three, knee. Oh, there it is, little Boston. I should probably listen to it before I put it on. Step touch. Big step. Knees up and pull it down. Hamstring, reach and pull. Knees up front, right here. Hamstrings. Two knees, two hands, two knees, two hands, two knees, two hands. One more time, two knees, two hands, and a center squat, bring it down and up. Watch that squat, watch that form. You're gonna drop it down, push through the heels, weights in the heels, you should be able to lift your toes up. Reach for the floor, right hand, left hand. Chin up, keep watching me. Hopefully you guys have all figured out how to put me on your TV. I knew one day I was gonna make it into TVs all over the city. And the overhead extension. And not just on the news, in the police blotter. Keep going. Chin up. Weight back in the heels. Get ready. Pulse it down, push that fanny back. Widen the stance, little lunge. Take it side to side, watch those knees. You can use the hands as a guide. Now reach across the chest, or up that back. Up overhead, warm it up. Out in front. Down by, 
Down by your toes. Woo. Stay here. In front, push it. Overhead, press it. Out front, push it. By your toes, press it down. Out front, two, push. Overhead, press. In front, push. Down low, press. In front, push. Up high. In front. Down low. One more time through. In front. Up high. In front. Down low. Wide squat. Center squat. Down and up. Two more. Pulse it down. A little pulse. Hands on your quads. Knees are back. Stay here. Round your back. Exhale, release it. Round your back, roll it up about halfway. Exhale, roll it down. Roll it up about halfway. Exhale, roll it down. This time, roll it all the way up. Bring the feet in. Shoulders back. Elbows back. Arms back. Great big deep breath. If you need water, get water. Otherwise, you're gonna start to march. So we're gonna go into that cardio. Get our heart rate up. Warming up, getting those endorphins going. Ready, set, level one, march, level two, jog, level three, run, let's go. So again, talking about anxiety, depression, this right here releases endorphins. Makes you feel good. Makes you feel better about yourself, about what's going on. But it makes your head isn't anything to know about. Yeah, yeah, whatever it is. We're gonna take it into a jumping jack, level one. Level two. Level three is just faster. So Linda, you were video calling me just as I was setting up. I don't know if that was an accident. You know which Linda you are? If you've tried to call me. Keep it going. So I don't know if that was an accident. If it was, good. If it wasn't, you wanted to talk, send me a message and I'll call you after this. And a jump rope. I was just getting everything set up and I didn't have time or I was going to be late. Remember level two, level three is just faster or you add a high jump and a couple of jumps. So find what works for you. We all have such long hair now. We've all passed that phase where you need a haircut. As long as my hair has been a long time. We're gonna take it side to side, or hop, hop, or fast. Jump that puddle, side to side. That foot can come back, level one can be here. So it's not a speed skater, but it's a little hop on one foot. Land on that nice flat foot. Again, level one, you can be here. Level two gets a little hop, level three is just faster. We're gonna go into a one, two, three knee. Ready? One, two, three, knee. Or one, two, three, knee. Or one, two, three, knee. Up to you. I want you to challenge yourself. If you're doing it on the carpet, be careful. Come out to the floor if you can. Off the carpet. Makes too much racket for me. Now we're going to go into a shuffle. So level one can be a shuffle, squat, level two shuffle, touch the floor, level three is just faster. So again, level one, little squat, little squat. Just make sure on the squat that you're throwing the hips back, you're keeping the chin up. And the knees are behind the toes the whole time. It's like some weird techno stuff. Got to take it in a Heisman. So it's kind of like jump the puddle, but you're going to bring that opposite elbow to the opposite knee. So level one, level two, level three is just faster. Woo! I can't take, I don't know the rights to the music. I don't even think they do. A little confused now. 
We're gonna take it into one jab, one jab. Right here, so level one. Out, in front, out, in front. Level two. Doreen, this one's for you. I saw it, I said, that's gonna make Doreen happy. And that's my goal. Make Doreen happy. Keep going. One jack, one jab. Then we're gonna go to a jab cross. Then step back, ready? Take a side. Jab, cross, step back. Jab, cross, step back. Jab, cross, step back. Level two can be a little faster. Just powerful punches. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Keep it going. Good punch. See that target. See that target. Jab, cross, step back. Powerful. Not just flailing your arms around. Ready? Other side. Jab, cross, step back. Jab, cross, step back. Jab, cross, step back. Come on. That's the TV. That's not what I'm on. When the news is on. We don't watch it anymore, right? We'll know it's time to go back to work when they tell us. Woo! If you watch the news all the time, you'll be able to avoid anxiety. Ready? Under the laundry line. Under, under. You can dip low. You can bring that knee up. Keep the chin up and the shoulders back. Get underneath that laundry line. You can get a little funky. Come on, make it work. I don't do that well. I try. Ooh, little Lenny Kravitz. Woo! Five more seconds. We're going to speed skater after this. In this speed skater. Get that cross. Whew. I'm getting warm. And Chris isn't even cooking. Finally put it together. I would like to open the windows. Today was not the day. All right, keep going. 10 more seconds and we're all gonna be in that march or jog. You guys are going faster than me, right? But your chin is up. Your hips are square. Here we go, march or jog. Feel that heart pounding in your chest. That means you're doing it right. When I start to count, I want fast feet. Ready, set, take it up right here. One, two, fast feet. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back it up. Darlene's right up front, right, Darlene? Second set, you ready? Take it up right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back it up. Cindy's right up front. I see my regulars, I see Anne Marie. I know where you are. I see you and I know who's in the back too. Last time, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, march. I got my Linda and my Linda. One of those called me. You know who you are. Woo! And step touch. Let's bring that heart rate down safely. So we went from here to here to here to here. We're gonna bring it here. So not all the way here. And an elbow back. Woo! Keep it going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. March. Another post I saw just before I came on the air was about our small businesses. So Hope Chess, I'm talking to you specifically. All those businesses that support us for our festival, remember them now. And let's help them get through this. Let's do our part, let's do what we can do. We're gonna do that balance. We're gonna do an oblique crunch. If you wanna use the chair, you can. Here you go, crunch. Now you know, if you can't do both, just mid side bend here. Otherwise, elbow to knee. Two more. Pulse it up, little pulse. 
four, three, two, one. Second set. So very specifically, certain businesses. We know Kathy's Salon. Four more. We know Kim Adelman's store. Those are the two that I know. I'll sit up right here. We know Karen Ross, business out in way or in Clarence. Third set, here we go. All those little restaurants that give us gift certificates. Two more. Last time, pulse it up. Eight, seven, and four, three, two, one. March it out. My cousin has a bar in downtown, kind of in uh, First Ward area. Maranaro's Lar Larkin Tavern. They're doing takeout fish fries. Get some food from there. Up here, Shannon at Curry's Pub. Let's go, pull it down. Yeah, I'm talking about food. We gotta work out to work that up. Let's support those who support us though. Pulse it. And if I'm not mentioning your business, it's not personal. I just have the attention span of driftwood. Second set, here you go. Pull it down. Pull it down. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Pulse it up. Now I'm tapping between each one. And then here, I have a very hard time balancing on this foot. Third set, here we go. I know a lot of it is in my head because I say that and I make it true. Four more. Two more. Pulse it off, last time, this side. Eight, seven, just give me that side bend. Four, three, two, one. Come center, break your deep breath. One more time. Reach and pull. Other side. And release that. You're gonna get some water. We're gonna get that chair. Why not? So we're gonna sit down. And I know we did some, we did some of these earlier in the week. I don't know if we did a Monday or Saturday. But we're going to do these. So we're going to rest. Now how we've done these with the stability ball. We can do the same thing with the chair. Now, we're going to be lunging down and you're going to feel that here. If you can't be here or that's too hot, you can use the couch. That might be lower. You can just be here on the floor. If you have a yoga block, you can have your foot up on the yoga block. That's up to you. I'm going to get my weights. I'm gonna get some water. You guys got yours while I was talking. Okay. So we're gonna start with both weights. Weights, the chair's on our side. We're gonna start with an up front row. So it's this movement here. You have two zippers on your coat, winter coat. One of those coats from the 80s or like a baby's overall. Shoulders back, weights in the heels, soft knees. Zip up that coat, all the way up, all the way down. Exhale, inhale. Again, shoulders are back, spine is in neutral. Now you're gonna do one side at a time. Reach it up, reach it up. So don't let that body rock. The weights are just hanging off the fingertips. If you're using laundry detergent, you have that handles right here. Keep it going, four more. Two more. Double, double, pull them both up. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. Four more. Four, three, two. Alternate, right side, left side. Really starting to feel that. Delts and rhomboids. Keep it going, four more. Two more. Double, double, yes you can, yes you can. Breathe it out. 
four more. Four, I remember what I was gonna tell you guys earlier. Three, two, one, one side at a time. So another thing that exercise does for you is it boosts your immunity. Four more. And maintaining a healthy BMI creates a strong immunity, helps you fight things off. So you wanna do them together. Two and one. They usually go hand in hand. You notice that people that are fit tend to not get sick as often. It has to do with the exercise. It also has to do with what they're putting in their bodies. So it's not just exercise. MB, you know, my favorite thing. You cannot out-exercise a bad diet. So, your foot can be here, it can be on the floor. So where are we going? The leg that's gonna be up or the leg that's out straight, that's the leg you're gonna be pressing down. So if you're on the floor with that foot, that leg stays relatively straight. I want you to lock the knee out, but you're gonna keep it relatively straight, and you're gonna press and come back up. But again, the chin stays up. If you're gonna put your foot on the chair, you're here, there's a lot of space. So your hip and your knee and your ankle are all lined up. This foot is up. Press it down towards the floor. This leg bends, that leg stays straight. Down and up. Keep the chin up. Little Rick Astley. Four. We're gonna stay here. If you're comfortable there, stay there. Otherwise, add that draw back. So it's down, draw it up. Elbow comes up. If that chair is sliding out, really make sure that you're not pushing on it with the foot. Get ready, come down for two. So it's one, two. So if your foot's on the chair, you know the move. If you're on the floor, it looks like this. It's one, two, one, two. One, two, keep going. One, two, up, one, two, down. One, two, singles, press it down. Press it down, pull it up. That elbow's coming straight, straight up, right here. Four, three, two, down for two. Standing leg is starting to burn. You feel it in the glute, hamstring, groin on that leg that's lifted, or that's straight out on the floor. Third set, singles, here we go, yes you can, power through it. Mind over matter. Right now your butt is the matter. Four more. Two more. Down for two and up for two. You no know, boy, I almost forgot, I should mention. Cindy. Cindy's got all, all of your Mary Kay needs. Eventually you're gonna have to put makeup back on. Eventually people. Makeup and pants with zippers. Oh, oh. But we'll be ready, right, Cindy? Give me two more. One. Give me one more. Down for two. Up for two. Shake it out. Shake it out. We're going to keep that weight. We're going to bring it to the side. One arm. Extend it back. Back. So this elbow, it's not here. It's lifted. You're kicking back. Kick back. If you want to use the chair to line you up, I'm going to move it over so I'm showing you the right side. You're here. Don't hit your TV. You might upset somebody if you put a weight through it. Press it back for two. So it's one, two. You can be standing up. You don't have to lean on the chair. Just giving you some options. We all need options. One more. How about three pulses back, this arm? Yes, you can. If it gets too heavy, just range of motion and down. Or change to a lighter weight. Or use the remote control. Three, two, one, give me one more. Ooh, it's burning. Press it up eight times, yes you can. Yes you can. If I can do it, you can do it. Three, two, one, bring it down. That arm, cross the body. Up and over it. Up 
other leg. I have a push against the couch so I don't come out of the frame. Your foot can be all the way across. It doesn't really matter if it's on the edge or it's sitting here. Just think about the stability ball. Make sure that when you come down though, that the knee is not passing over the toe. Are you ready? Foot on the floor. Here we go. Press down. If you're supporting yourself on this leg, make sure you're not on the knee. You're on the quad. I want you to really think about that quad as you press the body up. You're going to feel the glute do the work and the quad. So you're going to reach. Keep that shin up. Nice neutral spine. Down for two. So it's one, two, up. One, two. One, two. You know, if anything starts to feel uncomfortable, if anything start, starts to feel like it's just not quite right, not that you don't like it, a twist or a pull, come down to the floor. Here we go. Down for two. I don't think I like this mix. I think I'll get rid of it after today. Singles right here. It's a little more obvious because I'm uploading these to YouTube. If I use the same music, if I wear the same outfit, I'm trying to keep it new. Down for two, right here. Up for two, again. Keep it going. So hopefully these times are working out for everybody. But again, they're going to YouTube after this. You can find them at any time. Singles, here we go. Just look for Don Mac. Subscribe to my channel. All of these workouts that we've been doing this whole time are on there. You don't have to scroll through Facebook for an hour to find them. Down for two and up for two. I might be the only person from the 80s that does not like you two. Sorry, you two. Again. Give me two more. Give me one more. Come on down. Shake that out. Weights by your side. Bend, lean forward, elbow back. Press it back. Press it back. Woo. Keep going. So I like the chair. You can use that to even rest on. It will help you with your form. This weight's getting heavy for me. You guys keep going. Yeah, I know. But I want to make sure I'm showing you right form. Three pulses. Three. Two, one. Three, two, one. Again. One more. Single tricep, press it back. Press it back. Watch that elbow, it stays up. Just swinging that in front of you. Two more. Three pulses back. Three, two, one. One, come down. Keep going. One more like that. Eight singles. Press them up. Pinky out. Pinky to ceiling. You're fancy. Hey, Rose, if you're watching, happy birthday to you. I know I have birthdays. And you sent them all to me. I'm going to figure out something fun to do with them. Three pulses back. I think we should add them all together. Keep going, right here. Again. Last time, pulse it up for eight, big pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Right down, check it out. That arm, I know what, I need the light weight. You guys are, you guys are warriors. Peggy, I know you're watching. My athlete. My rock stars. Every day, you guys. Every day, you inspire me. Okay, I'm gonna move the chair back. We'll come back to it. Second set of cardio. You're gonna get some water. I think we'll do Tabata again. So 20 seconds on, 10 second breaks. Make sure your weights are out of the way. 
So it's about getting the heart rate up high and then recovering in that small window. Conditioning. Weirdest mix ever. Looks much better on paper. So get that water. Be ready to go. When I say go, you're gonna get me fast speed, as fast as you can. As fast as you can. So make it a little faster than it was on Monday. Five seconds. Ready, set, go. Fast speed, let's go, fast as you can. Come on, challenge yourself. No one's there to see you. It doesn't matter if you're flailing your arms around, if sweat's flying, no one can see you. It doesn't matter if you do that when we're in the gym. It doesn't matter. It's what we're there for. If you leave and you're not sweaty, you can work hard enough. Three, two, one, stop. Second exercise is gonna be jumping jacks. You know your modifications. So you can be out here. Ready, set, go. Jump and jack as fast as you can. The arms don't have to come all the way up because that's going to slow you down. You can be here. You can be here. Just get it going. You can be here. You can hold the arms overhead. Feel my arms jiggling around. Three, two, one. Stop. Next, that's going to be those jump ropes. So you know your modifications. Darling, if you want to do your twist, do your twist. Just fast. Ready, set, go. So jump ropes. Here. Here. Or twist. Whatever you want to do, what makes you go faster. Just go fast. So I'm getting that heart rate up high. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, stop. We're going to jump that puddle. So again, you can be here. You don't have to leave the floor. Ready? Set, go, here we go. Let's go. So at least this music is a little better for Tabata. At least it feels like it's moving. Let's go. Side to side, keep it going. I'm gonna hit that chair. 10 more seconds, let's go. 10 more seconds to halfway. Come on, show your workouts, not mine. Three, two, one, stop. Halfway, we're turning around, we're coming back. Same four exercises, if I can remember them. Four things, there's a lot of things to remember. Ready, set, go, fast feet. Just ask me when I go to the grocery store and I had four things to get. I usually come back with one of those four things and about 18 other things. Come on, let's go. Come on, fast feet, get it going. Get it going. Ice cream is usually one of them. Three, two, one, stop. That's my advice. You guys know that already. Besides my husband and my sons, the other two men are Ben and Jerry. Jump ropes, ready, set, go. Let's go. Let's go. I know it's jumping jacks. It's okay. It's okay. We're not in order. Jump ropes. Darling, get it going. By anybody else. Anybody else wants to twist here too? Twist. Marine, twist. Twist like you're having a margarita in Cancun. Let's go. Three, two, one. Stop. Jumping jacks. You got about five seconds. Oh. Ready, set, jumping jacks, go. If you want to be here and go at this pace, you can. Otherwise, speed it up. Let's go. You got this one, then you only got one more. Make them count. Three, two, one. We got one more. Last set, best set. What did we do? What did we do? <laughs> I'm gonna do high knees. I know we didn't do high knees. But some of you remember what we did, so you do whatever it was. Otherwise, high knees, let's go. Get to the finish line. Let's go. Get them up there. You could be here. Come on. I told you four things was too many. I got three. High knees. Three, two, one. March it out. So we're gonna bring that heart rate down safely. Step touch. Ooh. Little elbow. Keep it going. Eight. And four, three, two, march it out. So we're bringing the heart rate down. You can keep the march. If your heart rate's real high, you're going to keep the march for the shoulder burners. Otherwise, you can plant your feet, give me a deep breath, stop halfway, 
circles forward. So I want it nice and relaxed. You're not up here. Relax it. If you have a shoulder issue, your arms can be a little lower. Take it back. They can be down here. Otherwise, you want to try and keep them level with the shoulders. Now a little flutter, up and down. Nice and easy. Easy peasy. Easy breezy. Take it back. You here, breezy? Are you there? Tap in front, here we go. Four. Is Pat still watching us from Arizona? Up overhead, I know we got some ladies in Florida. Two more. Seconds out of circles forward. Keep it going. Now take it back. Start to feel that burning. What is that burning feeling? We know what it is. Little pulse right here, little flutter up and down. A little lactic acid. Feels so good. Pulse it back. Little tap in front, go four. It's like some weird techno club music. Overhead, four, three. See if we were in Cancun, we'd be at a phone party right now. Third set, here we go. We've been in the pool for a phone party before. I know you ladies have, take it back. You Cancun crew, I know you have. Stacia, if you're watching, I know you have. Little flutter up and down. Take it back. Pulse it. Ah, oh, you're almost there. You got this. You got this. No problem. Tap in front. Four. Who's an athlete? You're an athlete. Up overhead for four. Four. Three. Two. One, bring it down, a little back. Ooh. Elbows back, arms back. For a big deep breath. Elbow across the body, oh that feels good. So we're gonna do some biceps. We're gonna do some sit down stand ups. Other side. So here's where I would say I could challenge you. If you have one of those old school steppers, you can have the stepper on the floor instead of the chair, because that's gonna be lower. Not everybody has one, a lot of people probably don't. I have one from way back in the day, from a gym that will remain nameless, that uh, closed one of the facilities. And Ellen Coleman got me one. So I have one here, and I have been doing old school step aerobics. So we're gonna start with the weights. We're gonna put them down right beside us. So your heels are right in front of the legs of the chair. If you wanna hold on to the weights, we're just gonna stand up, sit down, heels out, heels in. So every time they come back, they're gonna tap the front of the legs. Don't push the chair out from underneath you. Don't let your knees come forward. You're not sitting on the edge of the chair. You're sitting back every single time. There you go, four count. So I stand up, sit down, tap the heels, bring them in. Stand up, sit down, tap the heels, bring them in. So if you have the weight, it's the same movement. Up and down, here we go. So it's up, down, out, and in. Up, down. So another thing you can do, instead of the chair, when I do the chair moves, if you have a stability ball, and you're good at it, and you don't want to fall, then you can do the same movements that we're doing here on a stability ball. Just be careful on these. You want to make sure that you know the ball is there. Two more. Last one. Up, down, heels out, in. Stay here. So the heels are out. If you have the weights, you're going to bring that heel out. Shoulders back, now lift a leg, here. If it's too much with the weight on the leg, or if you didn't have the weight, you're right here. Just lift and lower. Lift, lower, lift, lower. Now take that heel out. 
So it's out and in, out and in. So again, you can have that weight on the leg or no weight. Now lift that leg up right here, toe straight up, slight bend in the knee, weight or no weight. Four more, here we go. Four, three, two, slide the heel out. Out and in, out and in. Woo! -hoo. Four more, starting to feel this. We're sitting down. We're sitting down, but you still feel it, right? Last set, lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Yes, you can. You have the weight on. Fight through it. Fight moving it. Two more. Slide the heel out last time. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Take that heel set it down. Lean into it. We're like that lady on channel 17. We're good sit and fit. Yeah. See? She's still on. Okay. So one weight or two weights. If you want to hold two weights in your arm or in your hand and you can't do that. Otherwise, elbows inside. Shoulders lowered. Weights by the foot all the way up to the chest. Then down to the ankle. Here we go. Up and down. Watch that grip on the weight. Down and up. Yeah, let's get loud. It's like a gentleman. Four. Three. Two, one, come up for two. So it's halfway, all the way. Keep your chin up, keep watching me. Foot is flat. So it's some of my bad habits, if you see them, don't do it. So again, this free arm, not on the knee. Back here, this arm that's working is not on top of the leg, it's inside the leg. If you take the feet out wider, you can flatten that back more. Up for three and down for one, it's three. Two, one, come down. Three, two, one, two more like that. One more like that. Up for one and down for three. So it's straight up, three, two, one. Straight up. Two more. One more. Up for four and down for four. So it's four, three, Two, down for four. Up for four. Down for four, in four, three, two, one. So we're gonna do that whole thing, other side. Weights or no weights? Feet by the legs of the chairs. If you've scooched up for the biceps, scooch back. We know the deal, hold the weights, put them on the floor. Up, down, out, and in. So it's up, down, heels out, Heels in. Up, down, heels out, heels in. So if you have a BOSU ball at home, I know you all have a BOSU ball at home. Half of you are going, what the hell is a BOSU ball? Out and in. Up, down. I know some of you want a challenge. Let's make it up, down, out and in. Up, down, out and in. Eight. Seven, six, five. You only got four more. You can do it. Give me two more. You don't have to do the jump, but if you can do it, do it. I think that's it, right? That's it. So weights or no weights. Leg out. Shoulders back and lift. So make sure it's the other leg. Shoulders back. We're a little closer to the edge of the chair now. If it's too heavy, move it over here. Slide it out. Out and in. Adductor, adductor. So add as we go out, add as we come in. Right here, lift and lower. Shoulders back, chin up. Four more. 
two more. Heel out and in. This is what happens when you don't listen to it first. Four more. Every time I hear that song now, I don't hear Phil Collins. Last time, lift and lower. I hear Mike Tyson in the air tonight. You guys know what that's from, right? Four more. Four. Three. Two. Slide that heel out. Out and in. You're almost there. Almost there. Last four. Power through it. Yes, you can. Two more. And set that heel down. Press it out. Okay. Foot up. Finia to the edge of the chair. Elbow inside. Hand on here, not on the knee. All the way up, all the way down. So I think one of the things that kind of helped me turn it around this week, because I was feeling a little bummed out on Monday, I decided we have to be according to some timelines. I don't know, I'm going to go with this. We've gone through more than we have left to go through. Fingers crossed. Up for two, here we go. This is not the new normal. This is a holding pattern right here. We're in a holding pattern. One more. There is a new normal coming up. Up for three. Down for one. It's three, two, one. We don't know what that is yet. We have no idea what that's going to look like. Up for one and down for three. Hopefully we can come out of this. Kinder, more caring, more concerned about our neighbors. One more. Up for four and down for four. Four, three, two, down for four. Hopefully you're treating those essential workers with love, respect, and understanding. Down for four. Come up for eight. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! So we're gonna stand up, press it out, bring it wide, pull it back. So that's if you're going out, if you have to go to the grocery store. Be nice to the ladies at the grocery store, the kids. Aloes are scared too, but they're there making sure we have our toilet paper. Other side. Maybe we'll all come out of this with the days. Mats, floor, let's go. I see, I forgot my mat. Can you grab my mat? Let's get your mats out. Hey, Matt. Is that on the floor? Oh my gosh, look how late it is. So, we have, oh my gosh, we're going to be going right into stretch and relaxation. So, we don't even need our weights. We'll do a real quick set of abs. Coming down, the time just flew by tonight. So, sitting down, hands behind your head, crunch and release. Crunch and release. Now reach one hand between your knees. Again, supporting that head, not yanking on it. Lifting the chest up towards the ceiling. Now both hands, reach them up. Reach up, come back. If you're uncomfortable there, you feel pressure in the neck, come back to here. Go back to that reach. Reach it. Four more. Two more. We're going to do both hands. Both hands reaching. Looks like this. Reach, come back. Reach, come back. So again, you can be here or you're here. In four, three, 
two, third and final set, hands behind the head. You keep crunching, I'm gonna get the phone here. Keep crunching. In four, three, two, you're gonna reach the hand, one hand at a time, reach, reach, reach. Four more, like that. In four, three, two, both hands finish strong. Eight, seven, six, four more, finish this. Finish what you started. Two more, and bring it down. Woo. Walk the feet out long. Walk the arms out long overhead. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, release. Inhale, right hand grabs the left arm, pull it a little farther over the top of the head. Exhale. Release that inhale, other side, grab that arm, pull it a little bit longer. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, release. Nice, long stretch. And release it. Draw the right knee into the chest, hold it tight to the body. Point the toes away from you. Flex them towards you. Point them away. Draw that knee across the body. Open the arm up long behind you. Look down that arm past the fingertips. Keep those shoulders flat on the floor. If you feel any pain in the lower back, just bring that knee back a little closer to the center of the body. Okay, bring it back. Support that leg, let it drop out to the side. Arm drops out long. Bring it center, straighten the leg, gentle rotation in that ankle. And the other way. Knee drops out, ankle crosses over, reach through, pull it in. And release it, other side, knee to the chest, point the toes away. Flex them towards you. Point them away. And bring the knee across the body. Shoulders stay flat on the floor. Open the arm up long. Bring it to center. Release it. Let it drop out to the side. Arm opens up. Bring it to center. Straighten that leg. Gentle rotation in the ankle. Way. Knee drops out, ankle crosses over, reach through, pull it in. And knees to chest, just hold them nice and tight to the body, give that gentle rock side to side. Bottom of the feet together, use the knees, or use the elbows to push the knees out, bottom of the feet together. Hands slip underneath the ankles, grab the outside of the shoes, just pull those knees back and give me a gentle rock side to side, happy baby. And release that, walk it out. Let the hands drop down by the side. Close the eyes. Every inhale is through the nose, every exhale is through the mouth. Slow and intentional. Release the tension across the, the shoulders and in the neck. Feel the shoulders melt into the mat. Feel the pressure go from the chest. Feel that spine melting into the mat. Feel that belly button rise to the ceiling on the inhale and come all the way down through the body to the floor on the exhale. Release the 
pressure and the tension on the backs of the legs. From the calves, through the ankles and the feet drop out and you're floating. You feel that ocean breeze. Deep breath in on the exhale, open the eyes, get the toes a little wiggle. Deep breath in, draw the right knee to the chest, hold it nice and tight. Exhale, inhale, left knee comes up to meet it. Exhale, hands behind the knees, great big deep breath. Inhale, on the exhale, sit up. I'm gonna take it to straddle stretch. So yes, we're all in this together, alone together. Without bending the knees, reach out front. But nobody is going through this the same. Nobody is going through this the same. Hands to one side. So we try our hardest to be kind, reserve judgment. How about we try not to be judgmental, but at least reserve it. Walk it over to the other side. One hand on each foot. Deep breath. Exhale, drop the chest down. One foot out, one foot to the inner thigh. The world would be a better place if when we feel that need to voice our opinion, we zipped it. Unless somebody specifically asks you. Foot up and over. Elbow, look over the shoulder. And down onto the hip, stack the knees, stack the hips, press the pelvis forward. Okay, other side, foot to the inner thigh, reach for the toes, watch that knee. So look for the other videos, look for Linda, look for Ellen, look for Arissa, look for Kathy, look for Stacia, look for Alex. We're all out here, we're all trying our best to keep you motivated. Put up and over, and I guarantee you, it's hard for all of us to put ourselves on a public platform, but we care about you guys and we will keep doing it. In spandex, on Facebook Live, that takes some courage. And I'm not talking about me. I just like to be on it. I like to hear my voice. Strong women, strong men. They're for you. Okay, let's find that pulse. Wrist or neck? Start counting now. And stop. So you should be close to that starting number. You know what your number was, I can't hear you guys. So if it's a little high or it's a little low, stay on the floor for a minute. Otherwise, if it's in a good place and you're comfortable with it, your feet come in, push that weight forward, hands on the floor. If your chair's close by and you want to use it, use it, roll it up. Shoulders back, elbows back, arms back. Great big deep breath, reach and pull to one side. Make sure you're hydrating. Make sure you're getting outside. Other side. Hands behind your back. One hand grabs the other. Open up the front of the shoulders. We'll be here Saturday morning at 8.30. If you need me, you know how to reach me. Message me. Otherwise, I will see you Saturday morning. Stay inside. Be kind to each other. <laughs>